What's up guys, back in today with another reaction to JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Stone Ocean, this time with part 3, uh, episodes 31 and 32. Really looking forward to these episodes, the last couple of episodes are some of my favourites. Um, where, I don't really know even where to start, <laughs> there's so many villains going around right now. Uh, Weather Report's memories just came back and he seems to be another kind of um, antagonist type figure again. It seems like he's against Poochie, so maybe not a full-on antagonist but um again it's just a uh, very uh, very chaotic right now um snails all over the place uh we ended up getting emporio back i think at the end of last episode again i'm not 100 sure but that has been um just over a week since i did watch the last couple episodes but um again very much excited for this uh, ending span of jojo's um have heard a lot of a uh, lot of very good things no spoilers as of yet not for a lack of trying though, I've seen so many uh, kind of YouTube videos pop up on my home feed but um, I've just had to kind of almost completely log out of my uh, main account until I upload a video um, where if I do catch my, I try and instantly click uh, to the videos but um, again luckily enough haven't been uh, spoiled as of yet. Um, do let me know what you guys think about this episode though down in the comment section. Make sure to leave a like on the video if you guys do like this video and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date with these weekly reactions and let's get right into it guys. Yeah, I'm not really sure how I was going to do that intro, to be honest. Again, there was so much going on in the last couple of episodes. We went from just a, a kind of reasonably normal stand fight to absolute fucking chaos. And it kind of seems like all these antagonists don't really like each other as well. Oh, we got a flashback. Oh. Damn. That was just the nail in the coffin then, I guess. And it died. Oh, wow. Oh, crap. Are these Weather Report and Poochie? I mean, Poochie's quite obvious right there, but... Damn. I guess maybe that's not Poochie. Uh, Weather Report. Is that what she told him? Dominic. How the hell did Weather Report come to be his brother? Has the um, has the uh, voiceover guy changed? I feel like he has. I feel like the the voiceovers were a little bit more vibrant in uh, in previous parts, weren't they? I do just want to go back to that though, because I did miss a, a line here or there. Two fourteen. But um, yeah, I feel like the uh, got a different um, what's it called? Commentator. Uh, I forget what they're called. I feel like this guy they're saying it right now has got a very sweet and uh, somber voice, hasn't he? Quite relaxing. But yeah, I can't help but feel like it's changed over the time.
What was that? Clergy man. Clergyman. We have a limp. I wonder why that is. No, I think these type of people, these religious people like this, help anyone, don't they? Give anyone refuge. Left toes. Oh, and he's got that little bit of the uh, the arrow. Okay, there you go. <clears throat> and his toes have been fixed. Not sure how he done that. <laughs> Maybe he used the world and paused time and fixed them. Shit, is this his mother? Oh no. Oh maybe it is. It is. You got a feel for this woman, haven't you? Even though, again, she did do something very wrong. That pain onto another.
So he did have a brother. I guess that makes sense as to why there was two babies in the in the thing after the switch. So her baby just died. And so this is his actual brother, even though they look so different. Oh, that's Poochie, I guess. Oh shit, Z. <laughs> wow, you really broke a whole window to catch this guy. Where's what? So is it his brother or not? I don't, I, I don't know. <laughs> and there's another one of those Jotaro kind of hat hair type deals going on here, isn't it? I can't really tell. Is that his hair or is that his hat? Wetzel. Seems quite nice, to be honest. Yeah. That is his hair, then fair play to get it looking like that. I can say that about a hundred characters in the series are. Ah, interesting. Same woman from the diner. Boyfriend or guy. She's quite cute, isn't she? Arla. So, whether is the biological brother? Okay. Oh, oh God! Let me just put that together. Yeah. So. Well, obviously, it's the mother. Not obviously not Weber. But that is pretty fucked. He's, he now knows that they're brother and sister, right? Oh, that is the case, isn't it? Like, she is related to him. Is that why he hates him? Doesn't look like an awfully nice guy, does he? <clears throat> Kind of takes the sweetness out of that relationship, doesn't it? How's this guy racist? Just because he was born from a black guy. I mean, he's not even black himself. Oh, shit. It's just the... Uh... I think I've actually seen this. Is this the KKK? 
I think they. I think I did see this mentioned that they got censored. Which is understandable, I guess, for for little kids. <laughs> I, I don't know if you should bother censoring it for a kind of adult TV show. Um, no wonder fucking my report's got such a grudge. Jesus. But yeah, the people that got punished were the, unfortunately, were the uh, people least at fault. It did. He did try and help them. He did try and help them. What happened to Perla? What happened to her? Yeah, I had a feeling she'd kill herself. Damn. That is brutal. Fucking hell. This really didn't turn out very well for Poochie at all, did it? Again, he did he did actually kind of do his best and try to sort things out in a reasonably well manner, to be honest. Except he went to a KKK member. <laughs> Again, I'm not sure why they censored that. Is it really like the snowflakes really got that much power over today's media? Like you can't even show the KKK. I mean, it's not like anyone's going to be rooting for them. Well, obviously there will be, but a very, very minor amount of people, I imagine, are still like members or whatever who knows yeah I was going to say he's now probably going to turn to uh, the gift that Dio gave him Oh my god. The arrow really fucking got him. Jesus. And they just left his body there? I guess I haven't found him yet. And the arrow went through weather report as well. Okay. It's interesting that weather report was called weather before they even had weather report. Wow, what the fuck? 
What was that? What the hell? Is that just pure luck? Well, that scene out of Pulp Fiction. But it was brought ashore. <laughs> wow, I guess it wasn't just pure luck. Jeez. The meal does that snail trail on the left there kind of look like someone praying. Kind of like two hands up like this. happened here frozen well geez um no idea what's happened here 1953 i guess we'll just have to deal with it <laughs> 1953 uh, a bit annoying uh, I, I guess it's not the worst part ever to be frozen, I guess. A bit annoying though, isn't it? Try and see what he says in Japanese. Something about the greatest power. And he's not mistaken about it. What I got from that. I guess they have got the same hair, haven't they? And I just noticed that. And there's his memory. Well, not exactly. Where'd the horns come from? <laughs> so is that a hat? I can't tell. I feel like it must be because it's got fucking horns. But this is where this all comes down to, man. Interesting. Interesting. That was a really good flashback. But he still wants to die. So he's not a he's not the bastard we thought he was. Okay. It's just had a deeply fucking ruthless backstory, <laughs> Mr. Weather.
Very interesting episode that one, wasn't it? We'll go straight into the next one. Well, that was an awesome episode, in my opinion. Um, pretty much the whole episode was a flashback, and I'm I'm glad it was. I'm glad it wasn't kind of like split into kind of two episodes of flashbacks. That was really really great, wasn't it? Um, seeing Weather's backstory with uh, uh with um what's his name Poochie as well. Um, again, you actually do see the similarities between the two, although their skin colors are slightly uh dissimilar. Um, I think that obviously comes from the um. What's it called biracial uh, mixed race? Um, no, it's not mixed race. Uh, biracial, I think, is the word, isn't it? Um, biracial uh, relationship between the white woman and, and the black man. Um, obviously, Poochie a little bit darker. Uh, Weather report a little bit lighter. Um, again, both got the same hair though. Both both got the same coloured hair. Um, I even noticed. I think uh, Weather has got like these three little kind of strands at the back of his hair, which I think Poochie got um, after his kind of evolution kind of phase uh, during part two at the at the end of Stone Ocean part two. Um, so yeah, quite a lot of similarities between the two. Uh, really interested to see what um, what's on that disc of uh, of his sister, because um, I imagine that contains all her memories from the babyhood, which would be the most important part and most interesting part, won't it? Um, her going like seeing probably the switch. She probably doesn't even realise that she's got memories of that switch, but um, seeing the memories of them growing up as kids and such. Um, it's just a very unfortunate backstory for everyone involved, to be honest, wasn't it? All kind of led by the mother. Um, I kind of think the mother's actions were justified in her mind, but when you actually think about it they were actually very horrible that was a very horrible thing to do to be honest wasn't it uh give a give away your dead baby and um your your kind of life and your kind of yourself is already kind of ruined if you know what i'm saying she's already in a, in a bit of a rut and a very depressed state and such um i guess it made her slightly happier having an actual baby to look after and such but um you kind of moved your sadness and your depression which you still have um to an extent and she's still very guilty about it and you moved that onto another family um which is just not really fair is that you're kind of giving out two bits of depression instead of you just having your one um over here which uh, again i when i think of it that way it is actually uh, even worse than um but i originally thought the act was but very much understandable considering the, the uh, what they said about her um but yeah just a very intricate backstory to build us wasn't it very very awesome again kind of reminded me of um like a pulp fiction for example with uh, some of the backstory uh, segments and um just the settings as well like old school america was I've, I've really enjoyed this backstory to be honest with you um looking forward to seeing this fight between uh, Pucci and weather report as well um so again we'll uh, we'll get right into that now Four, three, two, one. Let's go. Did we have? No, we didn't have the opening, did we? Honestly, I don't really mind if they skip it to uh, skip it for a few episodes. Obviously, the more more story we get, the better. I'm actually guessing it's not pure luck, but it's actually the Joe Star kind of legacy that's keeping whoever report alive, I guess. <clears throat> okay, where'd these horns come from? We are going to get the opening. Where'd the horns come from? Is that just his evolution, perhaps? Is he's going to turn into a devil? <laughs> Who knows? Like did they just grow on the hat? Is it a hat? Is it his hair? Did he did he grow horns out of his actual head? <laughs> Again, so many questions about the hat, which is probably the very much the least important part about all this. I need to be aware of when this is going to change as well, don't I? Because uh, I, I imagine, don't know exactly know when, but I imagine it'll probably be during like the last three or four episodes. It's usually about that time, isn't it? Sometimes it's on like the very last couple of episodes. We're definitely going to say switch on. 
Sometimes they're very subtle changes as well. Although sometimes they play the whole opening in reverse. And very much are not subtle. <laughs> interesting to see which one it is this time around it is a very much kind of part three looking opening isn't it so i i'm, I'm kind of guessing they're going that direction with it can they not just kill that fucking these bugs <laughs> I mean, they've got these super powerful stands. They finally realized. Well, I hope you should. Guess that does make sense. Oh shit. Ah, that is a lot of blood. Is it the snails? How is he okay under the snails? Why? I guess he had time to learn about it. Almost cost his life. Interesting. But yeah, I guess, yeah, Pooch had a lot more time to actually understand whether Report Stan than whether Report himself did. Oh god. <laughs>
Why do you, why do you hold such a grudge about him? You are the, the person who the grudge is against, my dude. Can my phone please stop going off? Apologies, guys. Where is that baby, by the way? Oh shit. Damn, nice. That's some tea work right there. Let's go, Eva. Fuck. Why is it that Poochie's controlling his stand now? Is it something about light? Because the rainbows are a reflection of uh, something, and I, I forget exactly what. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. So you just gotta psych yourself out of it. Oh, he's blinded himself. Wow. It is. <laughs> Damn. So I'm guessing what Poochie done there was actually reflect a little bit of the rainbow into Anna Anastasia's eyes. <laughs> what was that? This stand is this. You can control blood? Frozen. They blew it and froze it. Damn. It is. A web report stand is cool as fuck, isn't it? it has so many applications.
very slowly, like a slug. <laughs> Coming for you very slowly. Said that before. I feel like if you stop saying that, we might actually win. <laughs> yeah. How was he able to do this? He's just kind of extracting the memories, perhaps. <laughs> oh shit. Let's go. I mean, he's got no legs. And he doesn't even want to live, so... Damn. I do doesn't even want to live, so why would he dodge that? Let's go, Weather. Or your sister, girlfriend. <laughs> oh. Go on, Weather. Well said. It's actually you that kind of went wrong somewhere along the way, Poochie. Again, he had pure intentions at one point. Is that Jolene?
This was from pretty terrible timing, wasn't it? All good timing, depending on what happens, I guess. He's moving. Weather's not dead though, because the snails would go, so. What happened to them? So he's got up. Oh shit. Well that's not good. We actually just saved Poochie. Wow. To gotta reverse that car into him. Oh wait, she's using the. Oh fuck. Damn. Used him as a shield, so she actually propelled herself off the tire. Bloody hell. Who is that there? The part of his new abilities. Ah, oh. what the hell? Ah, oh. interesting. Oh, well, I guess that's that problem dealt with. So I guess, yeah, I guess where report was already dead. We didn't actually kill him. That's a shame, isn't it? At least Anastasia is alive. But damn, that's one of my favourite characters right there, Weather. It's always some of the best side characters, isn't it, that get killed in JoJo's. Always. Yeah. Turning out, turning up was actually the worst thing, but we could have done. And there's the real weather. Dead. Well, at least he finally got his wish. Um, unfortunately, he didn't get his wish to to kill Poochie, but at least he died. It's funny that we're saying that. Like I said, it's always the best characters, isn't it? Part two, part three. I don't think anyone actually died in part four. But actually, Shigechi. I liked Shigechi a lot, to be honest. As much as people joke about Shigechi, I actually quite liked him. <laughs> Um, part 5 as well. Every part.
Got a disc. That is sister's disc, you reckon? Oh, that's his stand. Does that mean we can use that? Not sure how that works, to be honest. One more time. There he goes. Or weather. And such a fucking unfortunate history for weather right there. Oh god. Apologies, guys. See, so, yeah, I think, guys, for watching. Um, again, really unfortunate backstory there for everyone involved. To be honest, um, like I said for the first episode with Pucci, uh, weather report, um, his sister as well, of course, that that died, who was his girlfriend, which again was just massively messed up. The mother everyone involved in that situation was so unfortunate wasn't it and um again like i mentioned just now another one of my favorite side characters dead um as i meant it, it happens in every part with uh with caesar uh with kakuin um part four uh, again it was shigechi um again probably not probably not the worst one shigechi <laughs> like i said though i did really like him um i thought he was a cool guy um it's a sad death uh, sad, just, well, not not quite a sad sad death but not quite as loved character as again caesar and kakuin um what's his name uh the purple guy from part five i, I was never that big of a fan of uh, of him um who was the other one that died there as well i feel like there was a few deaths in part five um but uh butcherati um he was my favorite of the uh the joe bros in that one so it seems like pretty much all my uh all the my favorite joe bros seem to die every part uh weather report uh probably is my favorite joe bro for this part um unfortunately he has uh again died um kind of fit in death though to be honest he did want to die so it's not it's not as sour um as some of the other deaths that we've seen in the series um in in that sense it's not like he wanted to live on or anything yet he was living for revenge and living to die wasn't he so um he kind of got half of his wish hopefully jolene and co can actually kind of grant the other half of his wish and kill pucci uh, again i'm not really sure what pucci's kind of deal was with making weather report dies slowly um like i said during that part he, he's the one that the grudge is against let's be honest like i know what poochie tried his best to actually kind of help situations out but um inevitably his kind of intentions actually kind of turned to evil didn't they turn to turn to dio um so somewhere along the way he did uh, kind of again kind of went from those good trying to do good uh, to doing bad and actually doing bad he was trying to do good and done bad but now he's trying to do bad and is bad <laughs> if you, if you uh, get what i'm saying there but um really awesome episode today quite the emotional death for a weather report there as well hell of a fight though hell of a fight anastasia weather report put up um again kind of knew that they weren't going to win just because there's however many episodes left and of course they're going to have the main uh, main character um end up beating poochie in some way I, I do imagine anyway maybe maybe that might not happen this part maybe it might subvert expectations that way but um that usually is the case so of course knew that poochie wasn't going to die today but he got it fucking extremely close didn't he um but yeah hell of an episode hell of a couple episodes again i especially enjoyed the last episode um this one was really awesome but i really love the backstory for the characters again it adds that much more to the story doesn't it but yeah let me know you guys thought about these ones down in the comment section make sure to leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy this video and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date with my jojo's reactions i will be back um next week with episodes i think we're really near the end now aren't we yeah so i'll be back next week with episodes 34 uh, 33 and 34 uh week after with 35 and 36 and then 37 and 38 the week after that so very much reaching the end game now again thank you guys for supporting and have a good rest of your day